destruction zigzag. My kingdom will come to destruction and death. Be calm, Serene Highness. You must catch your breath. What dawn of disaster. Why speak you of death? I've had a dream. Hello, hello. What's today? Hey. An intelligent boy, oh, a remarkable boy. What's today, my fine young fellow? Today? Christmas Day! Oh, it's Christmas Day. It's Christmas Day. And I haven't missed it. The, 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 the spirits have done it all in one night. Well, they can do anything they like, of course they can. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a bunch of mechanical drawings. Otherwise, anybody could do it. You just sit doing one drawing. It's the way one drawing dovetails into another. How far it is apart and how you time it. That's the skill. And then you pump personality into it. It's like Fred Astaire saying, it's very easy. All I do is I put my feet in the air and then I start to dance. Well, that's what we do. It's very akin to what Fred Astaire does. Well, will a computer do that? A computer will join, you know, you take a, so, a side elevation, a top elevation and a side, and it'll turn it, turn a battleship. Marvelous. But we're not animating battleships. I mean, we're animating people who are pliable, plasticity, who react like people. It's personality. They can, unless computers develop personalities, in which case they'll take over everything, isn't it? So, the, 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 but it's partly fed by reading in magazines over the years that the animator does drawing number five and drawing number drawing number one drawing five and number nine and then a slave puts in drawing number three and another slave puts in drawing number seven and then two morons put in two four six and eight. that's not how it's done sometimes you work a production system like that but each draw there are no in-between drawings they're all important and it, it, it is we don't move at the same rate i mean we don't all move like king kong a King Kong could be beautifully animated by a computer. You've all seen that in animation. In comes the princess and kisses the prince. Like that. Well, a computer will do that for you if you want a robot prince kissing a robot thing. But, I mean, people don't kiss like that. I mean, if you're going to animate a kiss, it's a pretty hard thing to do. You have to do it with great skill and feel. Feel. That's what the hell I've been learning for 30 years. If it isn't feel and getting in there. Rembrandt, if he painted the man in the golden helmet, he might as well say, well, we'll get a computer to do that, program it for gold and program it for compassion and program it for irony and program it for texture and program it for drawing. I mean, it'll do it. You know, what, what the hell? Well, animation hasn't got as good as the man in the golden helmet, but it could do. My child, it is obvious to me that he is victim of the double whammy Split interlink incantation with Newt's eyeballs. It's not an artistic... Uh, it's not an art, Can I say artistic wank? It ain't. It's a full-scale thing. And it has to be, I mean, just to distribute the thief. I mean, he's got to make $50 million just to break even. So there's no question of doing it as like a little monk in the back room, even if we look like that. I mean, it's got to be a full, fully marketed blockbuster. It's a blockbuster film. It's got to be done like Star Wars or Lawrence of Arabia. That's what it is. And that, of course, is why it's taken us so long, because we've got armies to do, and we've got that machinery and the cast of characters on a big scale. It's the mammoth ego trip of Dick Williams. Oh, it's com complete. Totally. Uh, just about, except for one drawing, the link between what Gary was working on. That's right. the one, yeah. Okay, and that's well, the only one. Well, we can probably... Could you do that this afternoon? Sure. After, let's test it first. Okay. Shoot it first, and then, and then we can. Are the hands okay? I don't know. <coughs> uh, 
Uh, no, damn it. Well, it's the basket in between. You see how far the part... I've got one, two, three. You've got many f fewer ribs in the basket. Like there's four ribs and you've got three. Four ribs, three. When you go back to mine, it's four. Oh, I've got the spicing wrong, haven't I? Yeah, but if you put take it off the pegs, that'll... And use the ones the, pre the preceding one. Yeah. She's swinging Dodgy. fast there. No, she's slowing up now, so these ones are very important. Right in here. That one right. If a thing's moving broadly, I mean, like Teddy Lanamy, things through, you know, it's flying through the room. He's got them doing color tracing on a pot and pan that's flying. Nobody's ever going to see it. You have a, I mean, they'll never, but when things are close together, that's when you really have to work. The drawing, when the basket's at the end of its curve, you know, it's going up, slowing up. That's where you work real hard. And then when it's moving broadly, nobody's going to see it anyway. So do you think it'll work on the, on the fast movement? Yeah. Oh. When she pulls the thing, it's, you go rattle, rattle. It's like the rattle, rattle would be a result. So she go, and you have a little rattle. Yeah. But when she lets go, blowing, and it goes rattle, 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 rattle. That seems to be. Ah, I've got a bigger one to, on another track to come. Yeah. Shall I just play? It's just a, yes, yes, one again. That's good. You see, it feels wrong there. But that, that's good. That's good. Right, well, I'll show you the next one. I've got a deeper one for the sort of length of pipe going down into the hole. Ah. Oh. It's, it's, it sounds like a dog running around with a bunch of tin cans tied in its tail. A little bit. Mm-hmm. Whatever they are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, and then there's a big one for the turn yeah. on the end. Squeak, squeak. That's it. And with her little, you know. All her noises. Yeah. Perfect. Well, that's good. Go along with it. Ah, oh, it's good, I see. So if you use the other one, the tin can, very sparing. Well, yes, very likely. And that, that's, that's, that's and more there's, real. There's two of those to double it up and echo it when it's down in the hole yeah. in the ground. That's good. Um, this is squeaks to cover on the loose pipes to go in with the rattle we heard. That's it. Yeah! Yeah! That's it. And then, yeah. Darling pet. <laughs> That's it. That's it. That's, it. That's what I've been looking for for two years. <laughs> this is a culmination, what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to regroup animation. See, when you had the great Disney development, it was only through the Disney machine that you could do that, or the Disney whatever that was. Now, then when it all broke in from the 50s, 60s, 70s, all the equipment became available to individual artists. And I'm one of those. What I did was go back and learn the craft. And what I'm trying to do is re put the whole damn thing together again and take it in a new direction 
and then leave it. And then I'll go off and do my own things, which I think wouldn't be very commercial.